Hello friends in law fanatics myself lakshya a legal intern from dailyz today i am going to discuss about menstrua and ectasua these are two important concepts in criminal law that are often used together to determine a person's criminal liability menstrua it is a latin term that translates to guilty mind it refers to the mental state or intention of a person while committing a criminal offense it focuses on the mental element of a crime and examines the defendant's state of mind at the time of offense was committed menstrua involves analyzing factors such as the knowledge intent recklessness or negligence of the state different levels of menstrua exist ranging from the highest level of intention to lower levels of recklessness or negligence the specific menstrua requirement depends on the particular crime and its statutory definition ectasua ectasua is another latin term that translate to guilty act it refers to physical act or conduct that constitutes a crime it focuses on the external observer behavior or actions of the accused that are prohibited by the law ectasua encompasses not only the actual act committed but also certain circumstances or consequences prescribed by law for a person to be held criminally liable both menstrua and ectasua must be generally present this means that only must a person have committed the prohibited act but they also have had the required mental state while committing the act the combination of the guilty act and the guilty mind forms the basis for criminal liability in many jurisdictions thank you if you have any doubt please leave it in the comment section thank you